this is fire alarm system uh, in this uh, experiment the main component is uh, uh, photodiode whenever we uh, the fire uh, comes near the photodiode uh, it gives the uh, alarm using the buzzer and the LED, red LED is also turned on. Now I will take this fire near the photodiode. See the LED is turned on and the buzzer is giving the buzzing sound. When I remove the fire there is no alarm and LED turns on. When I move again So in this way, if the fire occurs in our house, it gives the buzzer sound. In this experiment, um, we are using uh, BC547 transistor and a photodiode uh, to detect the fire. Uh, so the name given as fire alarm system using BC547 and photodiode. So we are not using Arduino Uno board here. Without Arduino Uno board, how to detect the fire? So that I'm going to explain you now. So first I'll explain you how to do the connection. The positive terminal of the battery, it is connected to positive terminal of the buzzer and to the cathode of the photodiode. And the negative terminal of the buzzer is connected to anode of the LED. The cathode of the LED is connected to collector of the transistor. The base of the transistor is connected to anode of the photodiode and at the same time to the one terminal of register and emitter is connected to other terminal of the register and at the same time it is connected to negative terminal of the battery. This is about the connection. Okay, so how it works when there is no fire or when there is uh, fire means light. So when there when no light falls on a photodiode, so it will be in a off condition. When it is in off condition, this this part of the circuit acts as an open circuit. So when it is open, no there is no flow of current in the base terminal of the uh, transistor. So the transistor will be uh, the base emitter junction is not forward biased and it is turned off. It is in off condition. So when transistor is in off condition, the LED will be in off condition and buzzer is also in off condition. Now, when the fire comes near the photodiode, the light falls on photodiode. The diode is forward biased and it acts as a closed circuit. So when it acts as a closed circuit, current flows through this 100 ohm resistor and the voltage is developed between base and emitter junction of the transistor. Base emitter junction is forward biased and transistor goes into the conduction state. And when transistor goes into the conduction state, the current starts flowing from the positive terminal of the battery through the buzzer. The buzzer starts uh, on and through the LED and through the cathode and the collector, base, emitter and back to the battery. In this way, so when the transistor conducts, both buzzer and LED turns on when there is a light on a photodiode. When there is no light on photodiode, both buzzer and LED will be in off condition. So in this way, it detects the uh, fire. So you can uh, keep this circuit or a uh, system, the mini project uh, in your house. So if there is a fire, it gives you a buzzer and LED also turns on. So the components required and detailed connection, how to do the connection, I have written a procedure. So you can go through this. Uh, here the photodiode is used. The uh, positive terminal of the uh, photodiode, it is connected to the base of the transistor. Here I have used a BC547 uh, uh, transistor. This side is collector, middle one is base and the end is emitter. The positive of uh, photodiode, it is connected to the base of transistor. And uh, uh, the other end, cathode of the uh, photodiode, uh, it is connected to the positive terminal of the buzzer. This is positive terminal of the buzzer. 
and uh, the uh, negative terminal of the buzzer uh, it is connected to uh, post, uh, anode of led and the uh, cathode of the led it is connected to collector of uh, bc547 and the negative terminal of the battery it is connected to uh, one end of 100 ohm resistor and uh, the other end of 100 ohm resistor it is connected to the uh, base of the uh, photo the base of the uh, bc547 transistor and uh, this is all about the connection this is fire alarm system uh, in this uh, experiment the main component is uh, uh, photodiode whenever we uh, the fire uh, comes near the photodiode uh, it gives the uh, alarm using the buzzer and the led red led is also turned on now i'll take this fire near the photodiode see the led is turned on and the buzzer is giving the buzzing sound when i remove the fire there is no alarm and led turns on when i move again so in this way if the fire occurs in our house it gives the buzzer sound 